What's up guys, welcome to your sixth tutorial in Pi Game. And in this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you guys how to draw shapes. Now this is going to be an incredibly simple tutorial. So if you finally made it here through suffering for the last couple of tutorials, uh, you're in for a real treat. So the only thing um, all this is, this is just from the last tutorial. I pretty much deleted everything uh, except the screen object right here. All of this is just the housekeeping stuff. So let me show you guys what I got already and what this screen is is pretty much a basic black screen that we got so now let's go ahead and draw some shapes to it so let me guy give you guys a little uh, tidbit of information before you draw shapes before you draw a shape on the screen what you need to do is do something called lock the screen so as you see our display we stored in a variable called screen and now what we need to do is lock it so here's what you need to do to lock it put screen or whatever you named yours dot lock and what this does is lock your screen and what locking your screen means is nothing can happen on the screen until your shape finishes drawing and this is so when you start drawing your shape then nothing else can interfere with you until you're done and when you're done you probably want to unlock your screen so other stuff can happen so let's go ahead and well we can go ahead and unlock it now screen dot unlock in the middle and now in the middle of this between lock and unlock we want to begin drawing our shape let me move that up so here's how you draw a shape the draw module in Pi game has a bunch of built-in different shapes that you can draw the most basic one is a rectangle so in your Pi game module there's a submodule called draw and in that there's a built-in function called rectangle or R-E-C-T it's not rectangle I guess it's rect and in this built-in function all you have to do is give it a bunch of parameters and it draws a rectangle on the screen for you the first parameter it takes is what you want to draw your rectangle on and of course we want to draw it right on our display since it's the only thing we got so let's go ahead and write screen so screen the next parameter it takes is what color do you want your rectangle to be and let's just pick a random color and again this is a RGB value so let's give it a red value of like 140 um, a green value of 240 and a blue value of like I don't know 130 or something uh, don't use any decimal points for this and if you this again boo, 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 this is a RGB value so all the values have to be between uh, 0 and 255 if you write these all 0 it's gonna be black 255 for all it's gonna be white anything in between it's gonna be a cool color um if you want a specific color go look it up on like a table in Google or something now the last parameter it takes is what object you want to draw and put rect for this and now inside your rect put two parameters the first one is the position of your rectangle so where do we want the top left of our rectangle to be let's just put it at a hundred a hundred and this means it's going to be a hundred down and a hundred across so that's what the position is going to be the next parameter it takes in rect is what size do you want it to be well let's say we want our rectangle to be how wide do we want it to be um let's see 130 wide by how tall uh let's see like 170 tall so let me go ahead and run this and make sure i don't have any errors and then i'll describe one last time what we just did we drew a rectangle on our screen that was green evidently and this is a hundred across and a hundred down and the size is, oh, I don't know, I forgot what it is already. Um, the size is 130 by 170. So again, let me try to, there we go. The first thing we did is lock the screen. And this means, all right, lock the screen because we're about to draw something and we don't want anyone else messing with us while we do this. And next, we're going to draw, draw a rectangle using this built-in rect function. We want to draw it to the screen. We want it to be this color and we want to draw a rectangle object that's going to be positioned at 100 100 and it's going to be this big 
And then, when you're done with all that, you can go ahead and unlock it for us so we can do the rest of our game. So that is your basics on how to draw a rectangle. Um, again, not much to it. Really simple. A lot easier than our other tutorials. So um, in our next tutorial, I'm going to showing you how to draw other cool shapes uh, using different techniques. So uh, don't forget to watch. It's going to be awesome. So again, thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you next time.